Welcome to Saint Mary's Group of Institutions. This is Tanvi, and I'm currently pursuing B.Tech first year here. So here, there's a culture developed where the students aged about 16 years, and those such as diploma students and those who are pursuing B.Tech first year are able to build projects, learn various technologies, and and were able to get industrial exposure. So let's meet one of such student named Pragya. Hi, Pragya. How are you? Fine. How are you? I'm very well. Fine. Can you please introduce yourself? Yeah. So myself, Pragya from uh, B.Tech first year CSE brand. Uh, did you notice any any changes in yourself? Like how you were compared to one year ago? Yeah, when there have been a lot of quite a lot of changes after coming to Jure. Uh, it's I was kind of a lot nervous before like coming here, as I had to like live with me and uh, new people and different culture, different you know ideology, the mentality of people. Kind of nervous, but there was like a new thing here which I was really excited about. They told me in the first year itself, like we were gonna learn a lot about. Uh, you know, like uh, regarding like technology, like coding and all this. I was actually really nervous because in twelfth and eleventh, I haven't studied like uh, computer, so I was like, uh, I felt kind of you know like low compared to the others. Like, how could I you know like get along with them? Could I cope up with them and all that? Uh, uh, but here, you know, they taught me from scratch and gave me the confidence that I could do uh, a lot of wonders in regarding technology, technical work. So yeah, here. It's been more of a confidence and boosting of my energy. So, why do you think confidence confidence helped you in exploring and learning new things? Well, confidence actually is a very important uh, ailment. You know, like you need it. Even suppose you say you want to like wake up today and uh, you know like um, you want to do something. You need confidence that okay, you have to do this. So here, now let's say like suppose for the code, you have to do something. Uh, let's say like uh, okay, we are we are trying something new code. Okay. It's not working out. Uh, like we, I don't like lose up on my hope and give up. Like I be like, oh my god, I can't do this. Uh, let's give up. Uh, it's like I've I we, I try to find ways. You know, like a lot of ways. Like if this doesn't work, I try that. And then it's like uh, even if I don't get it at the end, it's not like I know everything. There's like people to help me. All these like you know developers and my teachers. There's all they're always there to help me to guide me. You know they always encourage our mistakes. Normally, you know we all are afraid of failure and mistakes. They 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 tell us that failure is like a very big crime like that. But here, you know, they let us like uh, ha- like mistakes happen. They be like learn through mistakes. So yeah, it's really good. So how did your moderators or teachers help you develop your se- self esteem while you are doing your project or while you are explaining to your projects to various other e- experts? So firstly, I kind of have a stage fear and a bit of social anxiety when I'm talking to new people. I was a lot nervous that when they told me that I have to explain people uh, all these uh, my all about my project and they're gonna come judge me and you know like give the feedback and all these stuff. So well, then the first project showcase, I was kind of nervous. Like two three people, we we kind of explained the project first. It started off with students. The moment they told the industrial experts would come, we were kind of nervous. But again, you know when the, when they came, they saw us. They gave us. Uh, they gave us that smile and you know the keen in the look in their eyes which was like keen to listen to us they were very interested in our project it was like a positive uh, vibe which they were giving us which made us feel more motivated you know like um, we could like give them uh, a lot of you know, information and tell them like whatever the difficulties they have go- are gone through during this uh, uh tech uh, the forward uh, the node.js projects and uh, react.js projects it was a really exciting and thrilling journey uh, we experienced a lot of things, and all the feedbacks they have given to us is very valuable. Uh, though, of course, we are not that of experienced people. In the first year itself, we have learned a very new thing. Uh, people have, you know, like even if we made mistakes, they didn't like directly demotivate us. They told, "Okay, this is what you have to do to correct this. This is what you missed out." That's what they told us in a polite, in a kind manner. You know, like they made they let us know that okay, doing mistakes is very it's it's common. It's like okay, like that. So, Pragya, can you actually let us know, like, what kind of strategies or techniques you have used to, you know, to b- boost up your confidence level so that even others can also follow that while learning something new and while learning something that's completely different, that's completely out of your do- domain. So, till date, it's been like maths, physics, chemistry, and all your life till you're twelve. So, BTEC, even BTEC, it's again same. The maths, yeah, physics, chemistry, yeah. everything. But here you were telling that you have gone into a completely different domain. So obviously, so what are some techniques that you have used to make sure that confidence, make sure when learning everything? Uh, so the first thing I believe mainly is in positiveness. Actually, like, okay, few things, let's say, like we have to talk facts. 
when it comes to like facts few facts are kind of negative those the truth here what i've started to believe is even though the fact is the negative one i i i try to believe it in a i take it in a positive manner i always um, i start my day with positiveness like so i starting i used to be like oh my god i can't do this to, after coming here you know i've like i have to do this you have to do this like we are we are going to crack this we're going to rock this that's how i i start my day and i tell suppose i feel something difficult you know and i feel like very demotivated i i i at some point you know we feel like giving up in something we'll be like okay we can't do this but no like again i tell myself like is this what you have been here for this is an opportunity which no one is getting you have to take it in and you know do better so yeah positivity is what is a lot needed it helps you a lot you know positiveness is not a, like people will be like what is the use of being positive no positiveness actually gives you a lot of changes you know like mentally and physically it lets you stay strong uh this uh, it's like you're always cheerful and you know like a happy vibe when you're positive like let okay like let's say like uh, suppose a technical problem is it it's not working out okay we know that it's not working out but we try to solve it in some other manner someone comes and tells ki you don't know this you can't do it okay you tell them you tell them okay sorry it's my mistake you listen to them you can't just be like suppose someone comes and tells you ki you can't do this okay let them talk in a harsh way but i i believe that okay let me take that harshness for now and then like you know, you know like listen to their uh, you know, what they want to tell me listen to their feedback and then you know show them do it and show it to them and then prove them ki i can do this you can't be motivated so that is what we have learned great to be here so as we conclude our discussion i would like to ask based on our conversation today what step do you feel inspired to take to to take further development in your confidence and proficiency in learning new technologies or like a new domain in your life yeah so started learning as i told i was really afraid of coding like i didn't know any basics nothing so here they're teaching us from scratch right so it's kind of like every detail is like clearly explained and you know like even if you don't know anything we don't we don't panic much we can just always they're there to part, uh, like we can go contact them they explain us in a you know like in a detailed manner we're not shy to ask anything um it's like uh, whatever thing we are starting like anything new topic or any new content we are starting now uh, as i told positivity is a main thing we start with and first you know like you explore it uh, like you explore it and then uh, after exploring you try to understand it like what uh, th- what uh, what does this function do or what this does so when you are you are understanding it right suppose you don't get it or you get stuck you first explore it so you explore it and then you work on it so that's how it there's like a step f- and flow for everything it's not like you you do where you get it it's a lot of flow so i'm still trying to get better you know like learn more on that yeah now very thank you pragya we were able to grab a lot of valuable insights from her yeah, and yes you. we wish her very all the best for you in your future thank you thank you yeah.